Hello everyone. After so long, welcome to my channel Security Beast. Today we are going to resume our pending project which we did started long back. So it's uh, reversing an assembly with the pi. Okay. So I'm back now. This is our pi. If you remember where we left, it is here. We have seen here in this R&D, we had this uh, heypy dot program, and this is working good. And this was our code from past screen, and this was the output. Hello, Arm Reverse Engineering. Have a wonderful day. And now we are going to start solving the challenges here. So this is the challenges called ProStar Challenge from Azira's lab. So she is the nice lady, nice researcher. Uh, it's called the Protostart Stack Overflow Challenges compiled for ARM version 6. So as you can see, we are at here. Uh, our processor is ARM v7, and we have three cores. Yeah, it's a Raspberry Pi 4 model B, the one which we compiled, and now we are going to solve our stack zero challenge so we just type something and let's see what it says it says try again so let me see gdb and the jeff is here so this has main yeah so we can see at somewhere here it is r3 is getting compare so I'd like to put break here and now run the program. Now let me see giving some input. Okay, you can see the breakpoint is hit. I want to step in now. Okay, next, next. Mm -hmm. So here you can see it's put it's put it's going to put something. Let me see what it's going to put. I think it's going to call the routine where it says ah try again now let me give some buffer here like maybe a 500 times or 100 times tada and again it hits the breakpoint where it is comparing R3 with something else let's see now we can see here in r0 there are there is our garbage and you can see we got the flag you have changed the variable so how we got the flag that we will discuss in tomorrow chapter okay so let me quit now let me reproduce the same dot slash tag zero and the give some garbage and let's see seg fault and you have modified the variable so that means we solved the first challenge successfully have a great day